So today we are going to be doing the three colour challenge again and of course we can mix it. If you want to see the rules again you're going to have to check my other video on it and so I'm using this water bottle, my water brushes, a paint palette and that's my piece of paper and of course my watercolour palette. So let's get started. These are my cards and I'm only going to pick out three. So three, two, one and my eyes are closed. I'm just going to take three, one, two and three. Okay. Now I'm just going to chuck those ones off to the side and open up the ones that I picked. Let's see. Red. Orange. And green. Okay, now let's get on with the drawing. So when I thought of those colours, I thought of drawing a bit like some building blocks and that's my sketch complete. So I'm going to start with the background now and I'm going to make it a brown background using the green and red because they're complementary colours and they'll make brown. So I'm just going to mix up the brown into my palette. Oop, too much red. So I'll just add a bit more green in there. That looks about good. So now I'm going to paint the background of the building blocks using that chocolatey colour that I just created. And now that the, I'm going to paint the building blocks now using my water brush again and I'm going to be using this peachy orange colour and this qualifies to, as orange to me okay. It's practically just orange with white in it so yeah. Now I'm going to add a bit of that into the paint palette. And then some green. and red to make a bit of like a brownish kind of colour on the spot but that was way too red so I'm just gonna get some more orange
try to revive that like woody colour of the blocks. So I'm just going to try and lighten up the colour using white. And that's good. Now I'm going to keep layering that until I get a nice flat colour. I tried to make the A block a bit darker than the Z one because it's like underneath that one. So I wanted to try and make it look like, oh, it's in the shadows, you know? So I'm, I think I'll make the A block orange and the Z um, red. And now I'll just paint in the Z. Wanna stay in the line. And just try to get a nice flat colour in there. And now I'm going to use the green. I mean orange. It's a bit reddish from the red that we added in, but it's fine. And those are the coloured blocks finished. And this is the finished product. I think it looks really nice. Uh, yeah, please like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one.